Here's a garden report for the end of August 2018. The grass has recovered as a result of rains that we've had. It's been a hot summer. Fairly good growth on my sweet potatoes. Quite pleased with those. There are six pots here, six large pots, and um, they're showing signs of getting a bit tired because the summer has been so long, but they're doing well. Ple quite pleased with those, and as you can see, some fairly large loofahs. And I'll also be collecting seeds from these nasturtiums planted. Okay. Oh, here is a little experiment that I did to try and see if I could catch some unwary chipmunks, but it didn't work. Not a single one. But you have to keep experimenting, you know. Lots of goldenrod, as you can see. That's the yellow flowers. Now, in the garden here, I have removed my mid-season, harvested my mid-season tomatoes, uh, potatoes, the uh, Yukon Gold. And immediately I had some clear ground, I sowed some more rocket, or arugula, and that's coming along very well. And then one of the next jobs will be to remove those late season potatoes. But um, these guys are still growing pretty fast and strong, so I'm going to leave those for a bit longer yet. Compost heaps doing well. Now the big news, of course, is all of the squash. Probably t starting today, I'm going to be removing those and putting them into warm storage so that they can cure properly for the winter. There's a selection here. You can see some butternut and some buttercup squash there. Not a lot of buttercup squash, but then I recall that I only planted one or two hills, actually, of buttercup, but they were about mm, 10 or 12 or even 14 hills of the butternut. Quite a few butternut and also some big zucchinis here. I left the zucchinis in there so that they could produce some seed for me for next year. Zucchinis did well. I got lots of zucchini marmalade. Planted a few more zucchinis to see if those would produce some more before the end of the year. Also a few late lettuces. Kale is doing well, but I probably sowed those a bit early. They're looking a bit too mature at the moment. There's still September growing time to come. Beans are showing signs of tiredness. I'll be harvesting those soon as well. Uh, tomatoes not doing particularly happily, but then that, that, that they've been going for a long time now. Still picking quite a few. Um, signs of tiredness too in the gladiolus. There are a few of the gladiolus um, small bulbs which are producing flowers but they're very weak. Also tiredness in the climbing beans, pole beans. I'll be harvesting those fairly soon too. And nice big but very weedy sweet potatoes here. They've done pretty well. I'm happy with those. And I must sow a lot more of the dill 
next year. I think I could probably sell some dill plants to the local supermarket. They didn't seem to have much of a selection this year. Okay, that's it for now. Talk to you later. It's quite a nice harvest of squash. 200 kilograms of butternut and 25 kilograms of buttercup. The largest butternut squash was three kilos and several of them were about half a kilo so average size about one and a half kilos or three pounds. The effect on the compost was quite dramatic but those vines are full of air and um, the compost pile will sink very fast once I add some soil and some extra nitrogen. Quite pleased with that.